Hey guys, I'm Drew Ricks here, and today I'm coming back at you with a special video because I have been waiting for these for so long. Uh, not really so long, but, you know, like two weeks. So essentially, this is an order from Forest Moon Bricks, uh, which is a relatively new third-party printing company, and they have created a lot of Star Wars-related content, so a ton of Imperial stuff. Uh, if you don't know, if you don't know, should I say, I believe Forest Moon is one of the uh, moons that revolves around Endor, so I think that that's where their name comes from. Uh, someone can feel free to correct me on that if I'm wrong, but I believe that's correct. So, why don't we just jump right into it? I'll get this bag open and we can take a look at some of the goodies. And as you might imagine, it's actually quite a large order, which is <laughs> why why it came in such a large box, but let me just get uh, one of each minifigure open so you guys can see generally what I got. Uh, there's no need for me to open every single version of the same figure, is essentially what I'm saying. So first of all, let's get this zoomed in. And what we have here, if I can fix the lighting, let's see, that's better. So first we have this Stormtrooper body. Uh, which just looks absolutely marvelous. The details and the accuracy, the screen accuracy is crazy. And then if you don't know about Forest Moon Bricks, one of their unique things is that they print on the inside of legs. Of course, this makes their product more expensive, but I think that in the end, this edition really, really takes their product to the next level. Uh, and it really just makes it 100% worthwhile. Uh, so, you know, I'm not gonna go to too much depth in this fig because I probably will do some sort of special feature on these in the future, kind of going in depth into it more, but I just wanted to show you that I got that. So besides that, uh, I also got some officers. Let's open a couple of them, a couple of the varieties that I got. So first we have what I believe would be considered a Stormtrooper Corps officer. Very simple black uniform quite similar to the TMC ones I got recently. The only difference being, as you guys might have been able to guess, is that the inside of the leg is printed on these. So then the next one that we have is this dark tan Imperial officer uniform. So very simple. Again, uh, not a lot to it. It's just an officer, but an awesome figure nonetheless. Uh, as you can see in other bags here, I did get Quite a variety of these mud troopers so why don't i open one of them and show you it i will do a more in-depth review of their whole mud trooper line in a future video but just to get this started off uh really quite awesome as you can see custom printed head just a regular lego helmet i just took it off so that you could see the head uh, and then he has this printed rebreather and then i believe that this is the bandolier figure so as you can see he obviously has a bandolier on his chest, and then he has the armor, and then also the custom fabric, which is just, you know, it makes this figure, it just makes the figure go above and beyond. So as you can see, there's mud troopers. I think I got eight of them or something like that. I'm not gonna go over, over every single one because there's too many variants, and so that's a whole video in and of itself. But I will go over the final specific figure that I got, which was Thrawn. So you might have noticed I did get the minifig co version of Thrawn recently, but I wanted to get this version to compare, and this version looks pretty stellar as well. The one difference between this and the minifig co version is that the minifig co does not print 360 degrees on the legs. They used a 360 degree, uh, I think, dual molded leg, uh, whereas Forest Moon Bricks, as you can see here, they just used a regular white leg and printed on the inside. So that's the main difference between the two, but I will be going into a review or a comparison video, should I say, of those two at a later date. So anyways, this was kind of the star of the show, uh, but it's really an awesome figure. Uh, I think I got 10 total or 12 total of these Stormtrooper bodies, so I should be able to make some guys pretty soon. But all in all, that was the haul. As I said, I'm not going to be going into too much specifics. Uh, about the individual figures themselves because they weren't their own videos. 
So keep your eyes out for that if you're interested in seeing more uh, and hearing more about what I think about these Forest Moon Bricks products. But anyways, uh, as I was saying, this is from a new third-party company based out of the UK. I did not mention that earlier, but they are in the UK. So this came on international shipping to me in the US, uh, but it's actually relatively fast. Uh, it took, I think, from the time they shipped a little bit under two weeks to arrive to my door. So that's pretty good shipping. I mean, that's faster than some domestic companies get it to you. So in my eyes, that's pretty impressive. Uh, but anyways, guys, as always, like, comment, subscribe to a little more stuff, and I'll catch you next time.